Romantic and mysterious. No one knows more about holiday camps than me. I've done it all. You have too, Ted. Mm. The bingo fiddle, the raffle yeah. fiddle, the racing racket, the kids' fancy dress fiddle. Uh, the... uh, now, that's not true, Spike. I never fiddle anyone under 21. Ted. What? <laughs> well, all right, 18. Mandoline for the windies. Although I don't use it on the mirrors. No, I find it much better if you just ha <laughs> ha Tiptoe through the tulips. Oh, with me. Oh, can I right. join in this time, please, Ted? Oh, certainly not. You can't have a pole on your head. You're only a chalet maid. Well, I've had a lot of experience with poles. Very <laughs> strict, he's dancing on the mat. On the top, on the top, that's enough of that. In the old bazaar in Cairo. Now, what are we going to do with you, eh? <laughs> oh, you haven't got any spare sink plugs as well, have you, Peggy? How's it gone missing? What, again? I don't know. Well, that's five this season already, Ted. You're not flogging him to the campus, are you? Oh, At nine o'clock, by the Olympic-sized swimming pool, we have the blindfold bicycle race, followed by the... Who can eat the most cake without being sick competition? Yvonne was born in 1914. <laughs> she comes from Southport, and her vital statistics are 32, 32, 32. Don't worry, Peggy. If the worst comes to the worst, one of us will sacrifice ourselves for the sake of your honour. Yes. Oh, would ya? <laughs> Oh, yeah, you probably would, wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> Gladys has got a nice. Well, I mean, she's properly stacked. And her mother, she's out here with a moustache. 